Hey folks, this is Shock, and you know how I've always told you that atheism is madness? Well, here's some more proof that atheism is madness. First of all, uh, as you know, I talk a lot about the madness of the Atheist Experience Show. I'm going to talk to you about that. We talk about the madness of Penn Jillette. We talk about that. And we also talk about the madness of Thunderfoot. Now, in this video here, you're going to hear atheist Matt Dillahunty admitting that Thunderfoot lost the debate with Ray Comfort. He even says, to use Matt's word, Thunderfoot, that was weak sauce. So, um, now, what is Matt talking about? If you'd like to see the debate where the atheist on YouTube, Thunderfoot, loses to Ray Comfort, you're going to go right here to shockonal.net. You see it right here? Just click below the video here and you'll go there. And then go down here and click links. Right here, links. Now, when you go to links, scroll down, scroll down, and then you're going to see this video here, the entire debate, where it says... Ray Comfort defeats Thunderfoot in debate. And and here's one thing that Thunderfoot uh, needs to do. Thunderfoot should contact Matt Dillahunty because Matt Dillahunty uh, said that Thunderfoot lost the debate. But Thunderfoot, I have something to show you that I think you would be interested in. You might want to contact Matt about it because listen closely you guys should click share right below this video here, share, and send this to your atheist friend. Because what you're about to see is proof that atheism is madness. In fact, atheism turns your rational thinking skills upside down. We're going to hear first Matt Dillahunty. I have a surprise for you here. You guys are going to be shocked by this, I guarantee you. You're going to hear Matt Dillahunty say that Thunderfoot lost the debate and it was horrible, you know watch and then thunderfoot if you're watching this i want to show you something that you need to talk to matt about and matter of fact all the atheists need to do an intervention with matt you'll see what i'm talking about in a moment watch this this is matt with the atheist experience show saying that thunderfoot lost the debate to ray comfort he says it was a horrible job thunderfoot did watch listen <laughs> He runs the way of the master, along with Kirk Cameron, who used to be a devout atheist. Um, I don't know what that means, but um, I was disappointed. Um, it wasn't miserable. It was. I, I think Thunderfoot let him get away with too much. Yeah, that's not kind of weak. Yeah, it was. I'm sorry, buddy, but it was weak sauce. You hear that? Sorry, Thunderfoot. It was weak sauce. So. Uh, the atheists are admitting that Thunderfoot lost the debate. Now, before I show you Matt here, <laughs> I told you atheism is madness. This is Matt. This guy is this guy here. This is the guy criticizing Thunderfoot. And this is how this guy shows that atheism is rational and correct. Look, I don't care how much you guys try to make atheism... <laughs> I don't care how much you guys try to make atheism seem rational and incorrect. I have to say this. Look, lipstick on a pig is still just lipstick on a pig. So so check this out. Um, in this video, Matt criticizes Thunderfoot, right? But over here, uh, I don't know what Matt's trying to tell us in this video, but listen close. <laughs> this is just... It's over. You can't write comedy like this, folks. This is Matt. This is this guy here. This guy was just criticizing Thunderfoot because he believes Thunderfoot uh, gives atheism a bad image. Well, what the hell is this? I never thought I would say this, but Thunderfoot at least has more dignity. <laughs> oh, you can't write comedy like this, folks. This is really... Watch. Here he goes. He's going to talk, talk about what he does in his spare time or something. Watch. Here, we, here goes... <laughs> here goes Matt Dillahunty with the Atheist Experience show. Yes. I'm happy to do any event anybody asks. Um, Maybe pop out of a cake? Who knows? As long as there's a time and a way to work it into schedules. Uh, but I don't see anything along the lines of it becoming a full-time career thing. As am I, and I don't... Now, there you go. Look, he's even got the eyelashes on. 
So I guess Matt Dillahunty may be, he said he's happy to do anything. Um, you guys can go watch this, his video here. I don't know, maybe Matt's popping out of cakes now. Maybe the Atheist Experience Show is going downhill financially. I don't know. Um, maybe they're trying to put on a softer side of... <laughs> it's just madness. Maybe they're trying to show the softer side of atheism. Folks, this is madness. Now, you want to see... Look, this is Matt on Friday night. <laughs> this is Matt on Monday morning. Friday night. Monday morning. Okay. If you guys want to see the debate that I, where uh, Matt, uh, or should I call him, what am I calling him now? Matilda? Let's call him Matilda. Matilda was referring to this debate here where Ray Comfort defeats Thunderfoot in debate. You will be shocked. In the debate, Thunderfoot questions, um, I'm sorry, Ray Comfort questions Thunderfoot and asks him, he says, you believe in the scriptures, don't you? And Thunderfoot says, yes. How do you see this debate? Click right below here, shockanow.net. Here it is. When you get there, the page will look like this. You go to this one, shockanow.net. Click below the video. You're going to click links and scroll down here. Remember, you want to look for the video that Matilda just told us about. <laughs> oh, this atheism is, you know, you got to admit, atheism's absolutely hilarious. It's hilarious. You can't write comedy like this, folks. And go here to where it says Ray Comfort Defeat Thun defeats Thunderfoot in debate. Even Matt Dillahunty admits that Thunderfoot lost the debate, and even Matilda Dill Dillahunty admits it. There you go, folks. You still think atheism is rational? You still think that this is the worldview that makes sense? Really? You really think so, huh? If so, we got a, we got a little bridge to sell to you.